just sent them on my phone. My mouse can't so catch him. So Who him? I don't know that guy. Nobody don't know him now. And this man has sent him up from town already. Book, uh, what you know now? This is shot you fly from another side. That's right, that them shot you fly like him get them that them shot you fly through from the next side or something. Oh, inside man and Oh, come in and see that shot. Oh, yeah, that must be going. Man, I'm born from inside that fly through. Pshhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhhh
him look like a chopper, him look like a trapper. It would lead to his demise. Now people, like me say, this man left his yard, left his house, left his family, his picnic on Monday. Did not tell them that he lived a double life. Did not tell them that he was going by himself or with an ex-person to buy some sorts of tool. There was no sorts of fear trade. The only thing is that his life and the next man's life was erased. Moral of the story is this. When you go into the 9 to 5 world corporate life, sometimes it is very slow. It is a little slow. However, it is more safe, it is more secure, it is more sure. Your life expectancy is higher. However, when you choose that ruggish, tuggish lifestyle, it is fast. It is more lucrative. Easy come, easy go. However, the end result is mostly the same. Two type of destination, destination doom in both cases, the big yard or the G-R-A-V-E yard. Even worse, whenever you are buying any sorts of tool in Jamaica, the chances of you getting some sorts of tool is very minimal. The chances of you getting some sorts of tool used against you and take that cash in which you was going to use to buy that tool is very high. These people don't come up with some sorts of scam. This is a sham. This is what you call work. These people are techer. Works. Sorry. These people are techer. They had no sorts of intention of giving you any sorts of tool. They've sold this tool in which they was going to carry whether it's a 9, whether it's a 4 fifth, whether it's a tall up, it does not matter which one of them. The end result was always going to be the same. So people, it is as if I wrote the script. I am going to give you an example of what might have happened when those persons went to buy that tool. They meet up with the people. Em. The people em always give themselves the advantageous position that means eh, you are drive you and your boy you in the driver seat your boy in the passenger seat the two sellers usually it is more than one this man and him crony him roll up in the thing him ask the question so i go on me here say want a four fifth or a nine for buy and then you answer yeah man you have one, don't it? Yeah, mama, have it with my mind. You don't know the thing going on. That we do, you know. Then you say, how much? He answers back. Then, brother, me not done tell you the price already, man. X, Y, Z, boom, bang, bang. As soon as you show that cash, he is not selling any tool for any post in a bag. He want to make sure he said the money did it. And then, wada, him wheel and pop off. Before you know, the clip is empty. That clip that is supposed to be yours from that tool that is supposed to be yours. The only thing of yours is the life that is gone and your partner. This is not something that is an isolated incident. These are not two people that I learned the hard way. It seems as if them not learn none at all. Like me say, in this life, in the street, you cannot afford to make mistake. A mistake will cause you your life. A mistake will let you end up behind those prison walls. So therefore, this is just a next two people will learn the hard way because they had aspirations of doing negative stuff. Romario, good youth, well respected in his corporate world, well respected in the call center management position. People them love him, hard working youth. However, he lost patience. And whenever you lose patience, you lose your life. Point blank and period. 
further on in the news. Do you remember when it was the gangster policy that little picnic out of bone, old lady, grandmother, grandfather, woman and even worse, pregnant woman is out of bone. They were untouchable. No matter what you did back in the days, when the people them come for you, they were real gangsters. Not like these nowadays wangsters. Them are take with everybody, everybody in the house, including old lady, mother, picnic, baby palm, B-R-E-A-S-T. Anybody can get it. They are all equal opportunity targets. I am speaking about an incident that occurred in a place called Hopewell District, Sandy Bay, that is in Hanover, where three persons were conned up. The three persons, a six-year-old, a 71-year-old man and a lady. People, remember me tell you. These are three categories that were once out of bound. However, they were conned up. Based on the Popo report, it is said that at about 5 p.m. on Sunday. Now, people, Sunday once used to be out of bound. However, like them say, the devil always finds work for idler. The devil, he is doing overtime. He is going hard in the paints. The family was there, including the three that got conned up. When some people entered the building, just before or after dinner time, blaze up the place. After the smoke clear, people realize, say, rotted, them three I get conned up. Rushed them at the place of recovery, the hospital that is they were admitted in a serious condition. Based on what the Pope Paul is saying, there is no sorts of motive. However, people, in my opinion, and remember, me not know everything, me only have X amount of subject. I'm a go at JC and my streetwise, and I'm a very rounded person, and that is why some of them blaggers hate me so. It has to be a reason. Me does I say, I think that they are sending a message to Quarko. Them I say Quarko. Just imagine if me do your grandfather so and me do the little pit in the house so. Just imagine whenever we see you what is going to happen. People again in my opinion if I was a family member of this family or Quarko whoever he is I would definitely stay away from this house until Two options, Quarko get rid of all of his opposition or Quarko lose him life and it kind of breathes out. Them send a warning or them send a message. Listen, we don't get the boy XYZ. So therefore, Una are right now, Una have immunity. No more DEATH sentence for the family. Everything is A OK right now. Take heed. Take this as a warning. These people serious. Based on what the Popo is saying, these three people together, including the six year old and the 71 year old man, get about eight pieces. Now we understand that these gangsters, they are not the best marksmen. Them never in a any part of the SWAT team. So maybe them blaze up eight and three connect people. Me no know me never did it. But me just as say. This is a warning that these people are sending. We are very serious. We want your family or we want your friend. Point blank and period. So anyways, people, thanks once again for checking out my video. If you appreciate videos like this, please show your appreciation by liking, commenting, sharing and subscribing to my channel. That is how YouTube promotes videos like these to like-minded, sensible people like yourself. And last but not least, please subscribe to my next channel. The link is in the description of this video. Bless up.